welcome into Rock Painting 101. I'm coming in with a quick doodle today to show you just how simple it is to create rocks to hide around town. Not every rock you do has to be completely 100% intricate, doesn't have to have a lot of craziness in it and a lot of work to make it beautiful. So I've got this simple gradient background on this rock here. It's just a plain flat rock that I wanted to add a pretty and simple flower to. So we're just gonna start by freehanding on a nice large circle like so and then we're going to add on some petals uh, to do your petals to kind of match what i like to do is give myself little hatch marks we're going to go vertically and horizontally and then we're going to split each of those in half as well and that gives you something to aim for when you're making your petals. It will help you kind of evenly distribute them around your rock. So I'm just going to make these nice, short, little stubby petals on this flower. And we're really going back to basics here. I just want to show you how to kind of conceptualize your flower on your rock. Splitting up your space before you do your petals can be a game changer in itself. There we go. All right, so we've got all of our petals along there. Now I'm just gonna do a fun graphic uh, style flower on here. So I'm gonna start by just adding in some horizontal lines here. And do this across the entire thing. I know this is very simple, but sometimes you just need to see a super simple design to kind of spark your creativity. You could definitely take this and run with it any direction you like. But we've been doing a lot of uh, gradient rocks, so I just want to show how simple you can add a design on top with black, and it will really make it pop. That color and the background looks awesome on them. Kind of thin there. Okay, now we've got our line down the center. Now we can decide what we want to do in our petals, if anything. You could always just leave it like this and hide it. Uh, but I'm going to take and make them kind of double thick on the outside edge. I can also fix this one here when I do that as well. So I'm just going to come back with my black. My black isn't writing. Sometimes you'll get something dust in there. There we go. I'll come back and I'm gonna make this tip thicker. Just like that. I'm gonna do that all the way around my rock. Okay, I finished those up and I wanna thicken up my center circle now that that line's thicker on the petals. I want this one to be a little thicker as well. There we go. Fill these in, the edges there. And you can kind of clean up your lines if you feel like you need to and get some paint down into those little holes or bumps if you've got any. How simple is that? So easy. I'm even gonna go in and I'm gonna add some dots into the petals just for fun. There we go. And there you have it. Isn't that so simple? It's super easy. Anybody can recreate something like that. I just want to show a fast, fun rock painting idea. I'll probably line the outside of this with black too, just to make it pop even more. I'll share a picture at the very end. Make sure you subscribe to the page Rock Painting 101 here on YouTube. We've got lots of videos coming and lots of videos in the archive for you to check out as well. Everybody have a fantastic day. Bye-bye.